What if I told you that Bitcoin's biggest challenge isn't waiting for the distant years 2140, but it's unfolding right now? Here's the twist. Every day, only 450 new Bitcoins are mined. A fraction of the 7,200 Bitcoins produced daily when the network first launched it back in 2009. Scarcity is intensifying. And the clock is ticking on decisions that will shape Bitcoin future. But it doesn't stop there. The mysterious Satoshi Nakamoto, you know, the Bitcoin elusive creator, holds over 1 million Bitcoin in untouched wallets. These coins worth around $95 billion at today's price of $95,000 per Bitcoin have never been moved. Why haven't they been spent? Could they be the lifeline that secure Bitcoin survival in the years to come? Stick with me because this is a story about scarcity, competition, and the futures of money that will impact all of us. As of January the 2nd, 2025, Bitcoin finds itself at a critical crossroad. The most recent halving, which occurred back in back in April 2024 cut the block's reward from 6.25 BTC to 3.125 BTC this means only 450 bitcoins are mined daily a massive drop from the early days of the network with the world's growing appetite for bitcoin this limited daily supply is a drop in an oceans of demand whether you are new to Bitcoin or a seasoned stacker, this is a conversation you need to hear. Bitcoin's having event or programmed into its DNA ensures that every four years, the amount of Bitcoins entering circulation is cut in half. In 2009, miners earned 50 BTC per block but this reward has decreased steadily over time. By 2012, it was 25 BTC, then 12.5 BTC in 2016, and 6.25 BTC in 2020. After the 2024 halving, miners now earn just 3.125 BTC per block. And by 2028, this was shrunk further to 1.5625 BTC and at that point only 225 Bitcoin will be mined daily. This built-in scarcity is what gives Bitcoin its deflationary nature but it also raises a crucial question. Can Bitcoin's network survive when blocks rewards eventually disappear? Today, miners worldwide share those 450 daily Bitcoin, driving intense competition. Mining is an expensive operation requiring advanced hardware and significant energy consumption. As block rewards decrease, miners will need to rely more heavily on transactions fee to stay profitable. But will transaction fees alone be enough to sustain the network? That's where Satoshi Nakamoto untouched Bitcoins could come into play. Over 1 million Bitcoin worth around $95 billion today sits dormant in wallets that haven't been touched since Bitcoin's inception. Many believe these coins were intentionally left unspent as a potential reserve, a safeguard for the network future. If miner becomes unprofitable or transaction fee fails to cover costs, these bitcoins could deploy to incentivize miner and ensures the blockchain continues to operate. While this idea is speculative, it showcases the foresight behind bitcoin's design. Beyond miners, bitcoin's long-term success depends on global adoption from individual stacking satoshis to nation states exploring bitcoin for reserves adoption is the ultimate incentive for the network's survival countries like russia iran and china are already mining bitcoin 
and using it to bypass economic sanction. This marks the beginnings of Bitcoin's role as a neutral decentralized currency on the geopolitical stage. As more nations adopt Bitcoin, they may also establish their own mining operations and run nodes, ensuring the network remains secure, decentralized, and resilient. Mining Bitcoin isn't just a technological challenge, it's an energy intensive process. Rising energy costs and environmental concerns are significant hurdles. But innovation is already addressing these challenges. Miners are harnessing renewable energy, nuclear power, and even tapping into stranded resources to reduce costs and lower emission. However, energy shortages remain a potential risk. In some regions, governments have restricted mining to conserve energy, underscoring the need for more sustainable mining solutions to secure Bitcoin future. When the last Bitcoin is mined at around 2140, blocks rewards will cease altogether and miners will rely entirely on transaction fees for revenue. Now whether this model will be sustainable depends entirely on adoption. As Bitcoin becomes more widely used, it, transactions volumes could rise, potentially driving fees high enough to sustain mining operation. If not, Satoshi Nakamoto's untouched Bitcoin could act as a lifeline, ensuring miner remain incentivized to secure the network. Bitcoin designs a fixed 21 million coin cap and its deflationary model makes it one of the scarcest assets in history. Imagine if Bitcoin achieved the same market capitalizations as Bitcoin, which stand at roughly $15 trillion. Each Bitcoin would then be worth around $700,000. For those stacking sats today, this isn't just a dream. It's a plausible future if Bitcoin continues its rise as digital gold. The last Bitcoin may one day be mine, but the story won't end there. Instead, it will mark the beginning of a new chapter. With only 450 Bitcoins being produced daily and blocks reward shrinking every four years, the network will face challenges that demand innovation, collaboration, and widespread adoption. Yet, Bitcoin design is resilient, community, and even Satoshi Nakamoto untouched reserves provide hope for its long-term survival. This is your chance to be part of history. Every Satoshi you stack, every person you educate, and every action you take helps shape the future of Bitcoin. If you found this discussion valuable, hit the like button, share this video with someone who needs to hear it, and subscribe to stay informed about the future of Bitcoin. Don't forget to hold tight and stack it right. Take care.